It's Wednesday, April 2nd, 2014. I'm Kevin Kerr, and this is your Southern Oklahoma Radio Center News. Yesterday was election day for a number of districts and cities. Julie Reuter won the number four Plainview Public Schools board member position over Burt Norton with 58.7% of the vote in their runoff race. The two received the most votes on February 11th, but neither garnered the 50% majority required by the state to officially take the seat. In Lone Grove, incumbents Eileen Duvall and Chris Young were unseated in their elections, making way for Chad Mansfield in the seat one race and Carl McCutcheon capturing 58.7% of the votes in the seat two race. In Sulphur, the Ward 1 Council seat went to challenger Derek Pretty. Unofficial poll numbers show Healton will vote no to a half-cent sales tax increase that would have helped with road improvements. Fox Public Schools will receive a $2.05 million bond that passed with 73.2% of the vote. And Mansville also passed its school bond issue that will provide a new roof and windows for the kindergarten through 8th grade building in Johnston County. Jared Barnes, the suspended interim police chief of Hilton, made an appearance in Carter County Court yesterday in regards to a protective order his wife filed against him last week. The Carter County Court Clerk's Office said the order was denied Tuesday by Judge Thomas Baldwin. The city of Hilton suspended Barnes in a special meeting last Saturday, but he's yet to release an official statement for their reasonings. Barnes was named interim police chief when his predecessor stepped down in January. The Carter County Sheriff's Department is currently investigating this issue. And that's your Southern Oklahoma Radio Center News. I'm Kevin Kerr.